Hey guys, welcome back. What am I, what? Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Um, if you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button and stick around. Oh my gosh, can we just talk about my fingers? Okay, so what happened was it, hot Cheetos and lemon juice happened and that's when my fingers look like this. So throughout the video, just ignore these two fingers right here, okay? Okay, wanted to review something for you because I happen to get it because my job is just that awesome and I love my job. Did I mention I love my job? It's pretty exciting, not gonna lie. Um, I actually, like, when I first saw it, I was like, mm, am I gonna get it? Should I get it? If you didn't know, by the title, I'm going to be reviewing the Nicole Guerrero and Anastasia um, Glow Kit. So, yeah, dude, I'm so excited for this. You have no idea. So, there's been a lot of, okay, you know what? Let me just save my, my spiel. For the video so yeah if you guys want to see my review on the nicole guerrero palette from with anastasia for glow kit then uh please keep watching and i will see you at the end of the video so as you know this nicole guerrero palette launches i believe march 3rd online and then march 15th in all sephora's um but actually right now it started this morning so from now for 48 oh since this morning, it's been 48 hours. So for 48 hours, she made her palette available on Sephora.com. Let me go make sure that it's still there before I, I put this in the video because that would be really rude. All right, see? Ooh, I mean, it is still in stock, people. So yes, as I'm speaking to you, hopefully it is still in stock by the time I get this video up. So she decided to, for 48 hours only, you could go ahead and try to get the palette, which it's still in stock, so you can still get it. Um, like I said, I don't know if I'll be uploading this within 48 hours, so it'd be pointless to listen to me. Start online March 15th in store, and it retails for $40. And I know everyone's been talking about, or actually I went through the reviews, there was like 100 something reviews on the Sephora app of this palette. And it just launched today, and all these people were doing all these really good reviews, and everyone's like saying, oh, all these fake reviews, you can't believe them because it just came out. How is anyone reviewing them, right? Let me just clear that up from one Sephora employee to you guys. Yes, some Sephoras have gotten them early, but that Sephora chooses whether they want to sell it. Actually, I don't even know if it's Sephora, like, the actual one you work at, or if it's just, like, a policy but um Sephora will tell you yes we have them but we're not putting them out until the launch day because that's what it says is the launch day so a lot of people are saying they went into their Sephora and asked if they had it they had it in the back so they sold it to people on the other hand we're not supposed to do that I mean the launch date you're supposed to launch them on the launch date that's the whole point of a launch date you feel me what's the point of a launch date if you're just going to go in and get them early. And against like people like the Sephora's that are giving them out, I just don't like the people that are getting mad if like they call it like your local Sephora and they say, no, they don't have them, but they do, they do technically have them. I don't see why people are getting mad because yeah, you want something, but it's, it's a company that is supposed to have a launch date. That's what that launch date is set in place for. What are saying these reviews are fake, Chances are they're not fake. People are getting them early because some Sephora's are, I guess, allowing people to come in and ask. And if they, they come in and ask, they give it to them. But like I said, um, what's going to happen when you sell out? Because everyone hears that you're giving, like, you're selling them before launch date. And then launch date comes around and you don't have any. All right. So anyways, enough about that. Yes, some Sephora's have them. Some are giving them out, some aren't letting them be on the floor until the day. Anyways, a little background on the collaboration. Um, I follow, or I've had Nicole Guerrero on my like YouTube stuff for a while, but I used to watch her a bunch and then I kind of just stopped watching her. And so I didn't really keep up with her. I think I probably stopped paying attention to her about whenever a Stan Beauty launched, like her her company I guess launched you could say so that's about the time that I stopped watching it um so I didn't really buy this palette for the fact that it's Nicole Guerrero it had nothing to do with that um and I really like I said I don't 
I didn't really, I wasn't a fan of like all the other glow kits. I'm really into the other glow kits that she had released, but then I saw this one. And let me just tell you one, I'm a sucker for packaging and this is just, it's hard to tell with my ring light, but it's just like pink and glittery and it's just, it's just pretty. So I'm like, okay, number one, packaging, check, okay? So then you pull this bad boy out and it's sparkly pink on the actual palette itself. And so I was like, okay, girl's best friend, pink glitter, what more could you ask for in a packaging, right? Well, then you open it up and you just, you just, I mean, my freaking dog is snoring. She literally never wants to be in here with me unless the camera's on. So she's under the blanket snoring. Are, it comes with six shades in the palette and I will tell you shades out of the six don't work that don't work for my skin tone because I am more fair and they are for darker complexion but I like that they did this I'm getting pissed at the people that are like well half those colors in the palette can't work for me one this would be perfect for if you're like doing freelancing because it has something for everybody it has something for fair skin medium tone skin and darker skin These are typically made like this for the purpose of freelancing I'm not saying they're only for freelancers but it's supposed to be more universal it's not supposed to be like all these six shades for deeper skin tone or all these six shades for fair skin it's supposed to be a variety of everything so that is what this has so i actually respected the fact that it had variety in it well let's just start by my opinion i love it <laughs> i'm obsessed with this palette guys not just for the packaging not just for the versatility i mean <laughs> i mean let's just talk about it for a minute i mean if aliens can't see me right now i don't know who can guys um yes i'm obsessed with this palette already um I don't know what more to say about it. The thing, another thing that I love about this palette, or what I mainly love about this palette, is not only does it have um, stuff that works for my skin tone, but I love to mix a lot of these. Like, you won't see me just wearing one highlighter out of here. I've been wearing it for probably like two days now. No. Yeah, about two days now. Like, I wore it yesterday, and then I put it on today. And I can't wear just one color. I mix usually forever lit. Forever Young, and sometimes I will do Kitty Cat, and then occasionally I'll do 143. But, like, you can see, like, the main highlight is going to be this Forever Lit, because, look at it. <laughs> oh my god, my freaking fingers. I thought I washed these enough, but apparently. Let me just tell you, don't ever eat lemon juice and hot Cheetos if you don't want your fingers to look like this, because they will. So let me go ahead and zoom you in just a little bit so you can see these a little better. Alright, so yeah. So I have Forever Lit on now, along with um, Forever Young, and then I believe I put 143 just a little bit. But the main two that you can see are these two. Yeah, that's basically my opinion on the palette. Now I'm going to go ahead and get into some swatches uh, on my arm. So you guys can see it just on my arm instead of just my face. And yeah, so let's go ahead and get into the swatches. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy it as much as I've been enjoying it. I think pretty much most of the population can agree that they outdid themselves on this glow kit. It's just girly and fun and fun colors. Something that works for everybody and I really think you guys are going to enjoy it just as much as I do. It launches March 3rd um, online and then March 15th in stores. So yeah. I would keep an eye out for it. I do think it's personally in store. I know it's going to sell out pretty quick. 
Um, because we've already had people calling asking about it um online. I don't know. I'm pretty sure to go by fast too. It still is online now. I'm pretty sure it's going to sell out fast. So if you can get your hands on it, if you can afford it, um $40 for six highlighters is a really good deal. Picks it up, make sure you tell me down below and like give me your feedback because I'm curious like how you felt about them. All that kind of stuff. Because you know I love hearing from you guys. You guys are so awesome. Sorry. I'm a little weird. I mean, a little bit. See you guys in my next video. If you have any suggestions, leave them down below. I did get a couple comments about like different suggestions. I'm still going to be filming those, so you know who you are if you ask for a request. I'm still going to be filming those. I just, this was fairly new, so I wanted to sit down. I already had my makeup on for the day, so I was like, this is just easier to sit down and film unless you guys know my thoughts. Alright guys, that is the end of the video. I love you guys. And make sure you subscribe so you can stick around and we can have this little family. Alright guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye!